Hey guys, thanks for joining me on Neri's Kitchen. Today we have Coach Jen in the house, one of our belly burn coaches, to share some of her special vegetarian recipes. Okay, today we have a cucumber tomato chickpea salad. It's my favorite and it's super fast. So let's see how fast I can do this, Jerome. First of all, we're gonna take our chickpeas. I did open the can ahead of time. We're gonna throw it into a strainer. Oops. And I like to rinse my chickpeas. So you just quickly run it over water and then let it drain while you do the rest of your ingredients. Um, it's up to you what you wanna put in here. I personally just keep it basic, but you can also add avocado like the day of or different types of peppers or onions. Um, sorry, I didn't expect this to be glass. Sorry for the noise. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it won't shatter, don't worry. <laughs> okay. mm. Mine at home is plastic. <laughs> All right, we'll cut this. So I like this one, it's good for summer, it's good for guests. Like let's say you have somebody over, you can quickly put it together. Calories are nice and low. It lasts three or four days in the fridge, so I definitely use this as meal prep every single week. Um, it's actually my lunch. Um, I will have the salad on its own, or I will pair it up with some quinoa or rice, depending if I want some extra carbs. With the belly burn, you know, you gotta balance your macros, so you gotta make sure uh, everything fits. So you can work with the quinoa or the rice to get high or low carbs on that, right? I mean, everything's carbs, but. Actually, with the quinoa, it's a complete protein. It is, it's delicious too. I actually didn't think I would like quinoa, but the more you eat it, the better it tastes. Okay, this here is a red onion. It's This one is um, optional, obviously, because some people like onions, some people don't. So, oh, here we go. I love red onions, by yeah, the way. Me too. I didn't in the past, but now, I, oh, I can just eat them like crazy. You know, I just do a rough chop. You don't have to be crazy, depending on how much time you have for your meal prep. And of course, when I'm on camera, I'm a little slower, you know? But chop it up, throw it in. I would actually do this whole onion because it's just delicious. It sounds good. Okay, throw it in. There we go, and then red pepper. Love my red peppers, but of course you could do green, yellow, orange. Um, as a vegetarian, of course this is good for all people, but I am a vegetarian, so we have to find ways to make our meals interesting. Mm -hmm. So try all your peppers, all your spices, pull out the spices. There's no um, calories in those spices for the most part. Let me go this way. And make sure you add lots of color. We eat with our eyes, right? So the more colorful exactly. it is, the more appealing it is. Exactly, exactly right. But a lot of, a lot of people I feel like, especially in the belly burn, they feel like simple is easier. They yes, want to grab and yes, go, right? Yes. But watch this, five minutes, you're gonna have an awesome salad that's gonna last you five days. This is pretty chunky. Um, I would go a little bit more fine on that, but for now, we're just gonna go like this. Do I have everything? Uh, we're gonna add hemp seeds. Go buy the package, make sure you punch everything in my fitness pal. I got my tablespoon here, it's two tablespoons. This is how often I make it, I know everything off heart. And so how many servings would this make? This makes six. Six servings? Six servings, I know, it's crazy. So that's two cucumbers. And um, I can give you all the ingredients if you want okay. to measure it out later. Uh, and then I estimate 10 um, tomatoes, 10 tomatoes. So two cucumbers, one green onion, one red pepper, I'd do the whole thing, 10 uh, tomatoes. And we'll pair that up with quinoa today. And don't forget the chickpeas. Oh yes, okay, great. Chickpeas. Okay, let's go two more here. Now I know we have some Ukrainians in our groups, so uh, I brought the dill. Rick Ooh. loves dill on his, so we're just gonna throw some dill on there. I don't measure my dill, I just throw it in, okay? Whoop. Oh. And then um, we got uh, salt, pepper, to taste however you like. I do punch these in my fitness pal, by the way. Hardly any calories, as Mary probably knows. You don't, yeah. Salt Throw and pepper, you don't need to. There we go. You know what I will need, Mary, is a spoon. If you yes. Like and then we're gonna go a quarter cup, any olive oil you have. Honestly, I like avocado oil, but this is what I had in the pantry today, so it doesn't really matter. Just go a quarter cup on both, nice, and full helpings right to the brim. 
This one is brand new. So and what's this? Crack it. This is white wine vinegar. Oh, white Delicious. wine vinegar. Mm -hmm. And uh, I can smell that dill. Can it you? Smells refreshing. Yes. Oh, can you try and open that? Oh, yes. <laughs> Jen, you're asking Sorry. the wrong person. Oh, okay. There we go. Nice. Jen here. Oh, <laughs> okay. Well, you know who's got the yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So this one, I honestly, I like my salads a little more vinegary than probably the average person. So I really give it a good pour. And then there's our spoon right here. Oh, yeah. Mix it up. Look at that. Look at how, oh, it just looks juicy. I love this. So I still would add some more pepper in here. Like I said, you can do avocado, but you want to do that the day of. Um, if you do that before, obviously you're going to get some brown avocado. And um, I'll show you how to meal prep it. And so how long do you let this sit for? Or can you eat it right away? You can eat it right away. Oh, yeah, okay. It's good cold, obviously. Mm -hmm. But I mean, it is pretty cold. The vegetables came out of the fridge. Right. Um, but it's also good for meal prep for like four or five days. I love it. Like, it's delicious. All right. So with our salad, I'm going to do a quick meal prep for you. So I got my containers. I know this already does six. I have it in my fitness pal. Six servings per salad. So that's one can of chickpeas, don't forget. I also pre-made some quinoa. So the quinoa takes about 40 minutes. I like the tri-colored uh, quinoa. And you wanna know my tip for quinoa is, don't make it with water, make it with vegetable broth. It's delicious, okay, try that. So grab your quinoa, go quarter cup. That's because I know I put that in my fitness pal and that is the serving for the quinoa. Uh, I, you know, if you go a little over, it's so we're going to go six servings here. Boom. And then for the salad itself, your serving size is one cup. Okay, so one giant, giant serving. Check this out. Oh, yeah. Mix her up. One giant serving. I like one that. serving, yeah. <laughs> and then I just pour it in. And then you just keep it in the fridge like this. And then once you, um, once you take it out of the fridge, you can mix it together. It tastes so good. Do you mix the quinoa like with yeah. the salad? Oh, you yeah. do. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and then also sometimes we'll add feta cheese to it. Which Ooh, really I was good that was too. what I was thinking. Yeah, I was thinking maybe a Greek salad yeah. with the cheese. Again, make sure you punch into my fitness pal if yes, you do. <laughs> yes, don't be just throwing stuff no. on there like we do sometimes. Ta-da! Look at that. We wow, look at that. Just like that. Five minutes. And so, Coach Jen, how many calories are in this serving? Well, there's 227 for the salad itself. So sometimes I'll eat that just on its own, depending on my macros. Then if you add quinoa or rice, you're looking at about 140 calories of carbs. So you got to make sure you punch everything in my fitness pal. All right. Thanks, Coach Jen, for you're sharing welcome. us this beautiful recipe. I can't wait to try it. Thanks, guys, for tuning in. I'll see you next week. Bye, Bye guys.